we're gonna add um, some complex numbers and subtract some complex numbers. So first, what is a complex number? It's gonna be something that can be written as A plus B I. The number that's here in the front, that's your real number, like a five, a seven, a 12, and then plus a number times I, and this is your imaginary portion. Okay, so here we go. I'm gonna add those two together. Ultimately, I am distributing a positive through this. Um, so one minus two I, we've got there in the front, and then a positive times a negative is a negative, so that's minus four, whoops. And then when I take a positive times a positive I, I have plus I. I'm gonna just color code that for you. We've got our numbers. The one and negative four are numbers, and then the negative two I and the I, those are our complex pieces. We wanna put like things together. So one minus four is negative three, and negative two I plus one I is negative I. One thing that does look a little bit different, that's just a formatting thing. If we had uh, five, let's say I had negative X minus three, we put the X's first and the numbers at the end in descending order, but we would like it to look like this format. So we put the number in the front and the I's afterwards. You're gonna be tempted to write negative I minus three and put the I's in the front because we're used to the variables being in the front. Okay, so just be mindful of the format. Right here, I'm gonna distribute this negative through. And when I distribute that through a negative negative, that's gonna be a plus six I. We can bring down the four minus I that's in front, highlighting the numbers and the complex pieces. So we have four, we have negative I plus six I. That makes 5i, but again, for formatting, instead of doing 5i plus 4, I want to put my number first and my i's at the end. So I'm going to write 4 plus 5i. Okay, last example, this one here. The negative, it needs to get distributed through. So let's bring down the negative 2 plus 3i and then distribute the negative through. So negative times positive 6 is minus 6 and then negative, negative eight I, that's gonna be plus eight I. Then it's gonna highlight this. Here are our numbers, our real pieces. Here are our complex, imaginary. All right, so negative two minus six is negative eight and three I and eight I is 11 I. We wanna put the number first. So I'm gonna have negative eight and then plus 11 I.